you think the window industry trade shows are big, you've never been to CES. I'm Tara Tafra, DWM publisher. Welcome to the February newscast. I'm joined this month by Casey Flores, DWM contributing editor. Welcome, Casey. Thank you. I know you were in Vegas for this massive event, which covers the consumer electronics industry. That's right. This show is huge. It takes up the entire Las Vegas Convention Center, two levels at the Sands, and ballrooms at the Westgate and the Venetian. In fact, they had 200,000 attendees this year. Wow. I know this event covers many segments, but there's an area set aside for residential products, right? Yes, that's right. And what we saw there was the latest in locking technology. One thing is evident. The traditional key is becoming a thing of the past. So this is Dirk Wyckoff from Unikey, and he's going to show us a little bit about residential and commercial lock systems that they have. So Unikey is the technology behind leading manufacturers in the space of locks. The ones that allow like Android or Intel, the technology that allows a smartphone in your possession, in your pocket, in your purse, to unlock a door simply by touch. So my phone in my possession starts communicating with my lock as soon as I touch it and open. Quickset's the largest manufacturer in the United States and technology behind Quickset also allows us to work with other smart lock manufacturers. Whether it's a residential lock in England, in the United, in the United Kingdom, or even you might see these types of locks if you live in a high rise or stay in a hotel. Simply by touch, and my phone allows me to open it. All the way to commercial access points. Unikey technology needs to understand if I'm on the inside or the outside of a home. So, by touching on the outside and affording me access, I can open the door, but when I'm on the inside in touch, you probably see a red light. So it understands whether I'm on the inside or outside, peering through my people in my hotel room, through the glass at my office, or my own door at home, only an authorized access each key holder can get in. Now, this app is always running because it runs off Bluetooth, so you can have it in your pocket. You don't have to get out your phone and push a button to open the door. It's, if it's you running. don't make the process easier to get in, you're using technology for the sake of technology. It's just a back door in. But if I want to go to an app and open, so in Pennsylvania, where I live, I can lock my front door, which is unlocked right now remotely mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. So if I want to do that, I have access to my house, I can let people in, I can send electronic keys, most importantly, I can delete electronic keys yeah. anytime I need. You told me that Unikey lock is $200, but you saw other similar products, correct? Yes. In the startup section, we ran into Lockatron, which had a more economical locking system. It had similar functions, but was less expensive and wasn't Bluetooth activated. Also, there were full model homes on display featuring the latest in smart home technology. That's where we found Anderson showing off its Verilock system. I saw they even won a CES award for that. Let's take a look. So here on the show floor at CES, there is a model home demonstrating the latest in smart home technology. Anderson Windows and Doors is part of that, and they've got a lock system to show off and some other things. So Rob here is going to tell us a little bit about that. Oh yeah, great. We're here at CES showing our new Verilock system, and it's an integrated wireless security system that's built right into the lock itself. And so you, there's no drilling holes, so you don't uh, ruin the warranty of the window. And it, uh, with the Verilock, it also not only shows you open and close, but it also tells you if your windows and doors are locked or unlocked. What's great about this is you can monitor it from your from an app like with Nexia, where it's a self-monitoring situation, which then you can also upgrade that into uh, videos and light switches and thermostat controls, or you can choose a professional monitoring route, such as with a company like, like ADT. That's what it looks like there. All the technology is built, like I said, into the lock itself. It's wireless, and so there's no wires that that you need to drill through the windows. Now do you have to replace the battery on that? There is a battery in here. The battery lasts from three to five years depending on the usage. So yes, it's a battery. Okay, great. And so I see that you won a CS Innovation Award or you're an honoree? We did. We won an honoree award for this, uh, for the smart home category. And so we're very proud of that. Uh, Finally, I saw a really cool product that could help dealers tremendously when it comes to their residential installations. So I'm with Furkan, he's with Levels 3D, a French company, and what they've got is an innovation that will expedite the measurement process for residential and commercial installations. Can you tell me about it, Furkan? Yeah, so we are a software company and we have developed a real-time 3D scanning application 
like you said, firstly dedicated to building professional, to scanner room, get the point cloud and use it on design software. What we are going to be able to do is also to generate in few months the floor plans with relevant measurement and also the 3D mockup of your room. Mm -hmm. And that, that happens just by taking the tablet yeah, and just act moving it around the room. Easily as you should and you will get all the professional data extraction. Now what, what's the name of the application? It's MyCaptor. My Captor. Yeah. First version will be commercialized beginning of February 2016. So that's some of the door and window related technology at CES. Thanks for your report, Casey. No problem. The event was quite the experience. Thanks for joining us for our February newscast. We'll see you next time.